we're back again to play some games <sighs> book seven book seven we're on book seven i'm excited i'm so excited <laughs> i don't even know what to say it's like before we start this i just want y'all to know that i am always team malleus <laughs> <laughs> I am always team Malleus. I don't know what he's gonna do. Because we know how these books work. He might do something crazy. But I am always, first and foremost, team Malleus. But I'm also gonna, you know, be logical. Just know that no matter what I say to Malleus, or what I say about Malleus, just know that, um, wife, wifey. I'm sticking with my man. I'm sticking beside him. And I wonder, compared to book book six, book six, it, it came out the gate swinging, you know? I wonder how book seven is going to start. die um also is the gonna go sleep since that's a major part of the story and also now i realize where the malleus not getting invited places joke comes from got it i never watched i never watched uh maleficent so they just left one person out mm, turn that turn that uh projector back on That dream. Why? Oh, hey, you're not Good morning to you, Grim. Good morning. You good? You jump up? What's all the fuss for? What's all the fuss for? Oh, I get it. You forgot to do your homework and now you gotta copy aces or someone else's, right? Never that. Well, get me in on that. There she is. Maleficent. Hey, Lauren, don't ditch me. What's the matter with you? Why are you gawking at that Great Seven statue? Something up with this Thorn Fairy Lady? Wait, was this inscription on the statue going to be on one of Train's quizzes? Let's see here. Looks like he's talking behind me. The Thorn Fairy who ruled over a dark mountain. Controller of the Thunderclouds and Briars. She possessed insurmountable magical might. A noble fairy who employed many servants, yet still retained a proud independence. That chapter was so short. (laughs) 
魔の山に君臨する茨の魔女雷雲や茨を操り何者にも覆せない魔力を持つ多くの配下を従えながらもここを愛した高尚な魔女と掘ってあるそして我がディアソムニアは彼女の高尚な精神に基づいた量だ。So says the inscription: Our dorm, Diasomnia, is built upon their deals with her noble spirit. Um, morning, Horden. Here you go. He told me I could, so. How dare you address my liege that way? I'll have you know that this man's the h a i r p a r e n t s of Briar Valley, the house one of the revered d i s o m n i a Dormitory. Get your boy. Get your boy, Malleus, please. Mm. In the leader of the noble creatures of the night, he is Malleus Draconia. Mm, never doing that. <laughs> Bow down and apologize for your transgressions, human. Whoa, I remember this dude. He's that loudmouth who was at the Coliseum during the culture fair. Uh, you're in the question club, right? You're in class 1D, right? Question club, yeah. With Riddle. And Silver. I really couldn't care less about your name. I am Sebek Zigvolt, loyal retainer to my liege. That's not happening. But enough about me. I demand you apologize this instant. Exactly. Get your boy. Get your boy. It's fine, Sebek. I'm the one who permitted this child and man to call me by the nickname Horton. No! No! Mm hmm, because I'm special. So、mm hmm. I get special treatment. Truly? Oh, I see. I'm his favorite human. Of course you did, my liege. Your heart is broader than the sea. Seas, I mean. Sebek, I'm going to ask you to ask me to ask you to ask me to ask you to ask me. Sebek, I think you're the one who needs to apologize after the unnecessary tirade. Mareus Sama no Goyu Jin ni Totsen Bure o Hataraitano. O my no Hota so. After all, you were just rude to Malice's friend, exactly. <laughs> I don't need a lecture from someone who just stood there staring blankly, Silver. Nanda Koitra, Konoma Yuri Mozutta Rusinda. What's up with these guys? They were more annoying than the last time we saw him. Lauren, are you interested in the legend of the Thorn Fairy? Yes. I'll be glad to answer any questions you have to the best of my ability. Did people exclude her from things a lot? Yeah. Exclude her. Can you send him away? Can you send him away, please? Would you just call me a Terra? A Timorite? Tem How could you even suggest that about one of the Honorable Great Seven? The Thorn Fairy's power was greater than anyone's, and she possessed the noblest of spirits. She commands the utmost respect. The very idea of people excluding her is ridiculous. Then why was she invited? I'm not so certain about that. I imagine people feared her and kept her at arm's length, specifically because of how exceptional she was. Respect grows into awe, and over time, awe turns into dread. Such is the way of things. Anyone foolish enough to fear the Thorn Fairy for such a trivial reason might as well be dirt. 
There's nothing to be gained from worrying about a little dirt. Refrain from pestering my liege with such impertinent questions, human. Exactly, exactly. Man, this guy's definition of condescending. Newsflash, buddy. You went to Thorn Fairy. Sebek, let it go. I dang. Oh, fiddlesticks. I'm late. To class? Or. Lilia, why are you in such a hurry? I may have overdone that binge gaming with an online buddy of mine last night. Idiya. Which caused me to oversleep. Silver, why didn't you wake me up? I did. Three times. Though you shouldn't expect me to manage your sleep schedule anyway. You know how much mine fluctuates. <laughs> You even have bedhead. You could have simply used magic to get ready and teleport to class in an instant. Though... You must still be waking up. Yes, well, anyway. Malleus. The juniors are supposed to meet in the lecture hall for first period today. You did remember that, right? Ah, uh, that's today, is it? Come now, you're a bit young to be going senile. Do the juniors have to attend some sort of special class today? Um. No, don't talk about it, don't talk about it. I don't want y'all to leave. You know how seniors and everyone in college go off campus for internships? They're holding orientation for those today. Internships start right at the beginning of September, and the spring flowers are already budding around us. We must start preparing accordingly. So, you know, Oh, yeah. Trey mentioned that back during the culture fair. Yes, There's the first bell. Malleus, Lilia. We must get moving. Uh. Bye, I guess. Right. Oh, I can do that. I can do that. Lauren, if you wish to learn more about the Thorn Fairy, come visit me in Dysomnia. Okay, goodbye. I'll tell you all you wish to know. Until then. Oi, Ningen! Hey human, don't let Malice's kindness go to your head. Don't let kindness go to your head. Remember, ramble like you normally wouldn't associate so freely with someone of his station. He is like the definition of a hater. The heck? I was joking about him being a, a third wheel in that one video, but he really is a third wheel. <laughs> Golly. Also, I'm surprised that Malleus just walked away. Usually he disappears in sparkles. Um, whoa. Check it out. It's Malleus Draconia in his entourage. Dude, for real? I'm kind of hurry. 
They're not gonna curse me or something if I overtake them on the way in, right? Sebek might? Surely not. But I understand what you mean. Even walking by them is nerve-wracking. Draconia's got monster tier magic power, right? Like, he's one of the top five mages in the world. For the experience, why would he enroll in the Arcan Academy? Not like he's gonna learn anything here. Who knows? You can never tell what he's thinking. It kind of makes him scary, actually. I had a class with him last year. Now swim bullets the whole time. But are you alive? Are you dead? No, you're good. I tried to make myself as invisible as possible, just so they'd be a lower chance he'd look at me. I say you do a good job of being invisible even when you don't try. You gonna take that? <laughs> are you being bullied? Okay. So the juniors should be Trey, Cater, Unk. Uh, no, no. Vil, Rook, Lilia, Malleus. Right? Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, idiot. <laughs> Forgot about him, too. I see all our juniors are present. Let's begin the orientation. This is for the off-campus internships we'll be doing in your senior year. Is it paid? Are they being paid? The internship program is 100% mandatory, so I suggest you pay close attention. Golly, paperwork. Now, I'd like you all to look at the first page of your syllabus. Golly, a syllabus. I haven't heard that name in a while. Internships begin in September, around the same time class starts. Each stint is three months, or one quarter. You can choose up to three internships over the course of the year. It's perfectly valid to devote all three quarters to a single in-depth internship. As is choosing a different internship each quarter to gain a wider breadth, breadth of experience. The internships are at businesses, research institutes, and foundations that cooperate with our school. But not every position is up for grabs. Be aware that your options will differ based on your electives, class credits, and grades. Man, does Ankh even have enough credits? <laughs> In addition to interviews, some internships have special exams you must pass to be eligible. Full details are included in the internship list at the back of the syllabus. Make sure you read it carefully before applying. Now, let me emphasize one thing. Do not choose any internships for funsies, as you kids say. Each 
each quarter you must receive an evaluation of B or higher at your internship and submit a report. You will not get credit without those two things. I'm bored. If you receive credit for two of the three quarters, then you'll qualify to take the graduation exam. This is a critical step in deciding your future career paths. I suggest you consider your options most thoroughly. Alright, that's all. Ta ta for now. Welp, it's finally that time. There's so many options. Not to narrow it down to just three? Where do I even start? Spots aren't first come, first serve either. We'll have interviews and tests. And I hear the most popular internships are super competitive. We better narrow down our options and work out a plan for them. I guess part of it depends on if you want to continue your education or get a job after graduation. How about you try? I plan getting a job. There's not much I want to study at the university level. I'll get nationally certified as a pastier, but I can earn those qualifications while working. So you think you'll enter at some kind of food business? That's my plan, but I'm also curious about agricultural research institutes. I've done some research on fertilizer and selective breeding in the science club. Still bored, still bored, <laughs> still bored. Quality sweets require quality ingredients, you know? Ooh, I getcha. When a specialized research institute makes allowances to accept students from our school, it's because Night Raven College graduates do exceptionally well there. It'd be a shame to waste such great opportunity while I have the chance. Oh, ne. Yeah, for real. I don't normally think about it, but looking at this list reminds me what a big deal our school is. Entame, IT, Shokhin, Gangu, Kayo Chosa, Yaiseki Hakutsu, Majifto no Protimu, Madarmone. Entertainment, IT, foodstuff, toys. There's even oceanic surveyors, ruined excavators, and a pro spell drive team on here. So you can't do anything. What do you think you'll do after graduation, Kater? Go the higher education route? Well, probably not that, huh? Chotto. So no kimetsuke wa shitsure nan janai? Wow. Way to assume, Trey. Ma, jisai shingaku yote wa nain desu kedo. Ore, benkyo wa ma suki janai shine. You're right, though. I'm not. I've never been big on studying. I'm thinking maybe I'll go for entertainment internship. Um, I'd be kind of interested in working on magazines or films. Oh, hey, there's also a theme park management company on here. Hey, Design shows and attractions. Ooh, that sounds fun. エースのお兄さんは研修先にそっち系の企業を選んでそのまま就職したらしいぞ。I 
I know we can switch after three months. But it'd be sad times if I picked something that wasn't my jam. It'd be hard to get credit then too. If I get a poor evaluation, that could negatively impact my future, right? Seriously. And even if you gel with your first internship. Do you stick with it for another three months? Or do you try something else to broaden your horizons? That's a tough choice to make. Right? This is hard. Like, really hard. There's only one thing to do at a time like this. See what everyone else is doing. People here tend to be pretty unique. I'm not sure crowdsourcing opinions would be all that useful. But hey, when else will we get to do this? Let's ask around. Now, who's the most approachable? Huh. Talk my ear off, why don't you? Talk my ear off! But honestly, I'd be stressed. <laughs> I gotta pick a, an internship. Do you think that Malleus will be able to find an internship? Because people are scared of him. So do you think that's gonna affect his senior year? Maybe, perhaps. Oh. Also, Sebek. Sebek is a hater. Like, I already... I already had, uh, thoughts about him, but... He, he, he does not like me. <laughs> anyway, this episode... World, world building. Yeah, some uh, Setting up. Setting up some stuff. Um... But nothing too crazy, you know? Nothing too crazy. Um, thank you for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on my social media. It's below. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.